doesn't get double teamed. Shoots over it anyway for two. Big bucket for Grant. We're right where we want to be. We have everything in front of us. A lot of basketball to be played. Um, you know, I think the A-10 is, is super competitive this year. There's some teams that are playing really great. Um, so I think it's going to be really awesome at the tournament to see all these teams compete. And, you know, I think we have a really good chance to finish out the season great. And looking back on it, you know, I have no regrets. Uh, super glad that I'm here. Super glad that I'm in another season with these guys and we're all competing together. And I wouldn't trade it for anything. Nobody really as a 18, 19 year old kid expects to collapse on the court and have to have heart surgery. Um, so that certainly gave me a lot of different perspective in a lot of different ways. And like you said, you know, having a brother that competes at the same level, um, especially in the Big East being the conference that it is, um, sort of having him there and sort of seeing, you know, what he goes through on a daily basis compared to what I go through on a daily basis, the similarities, the differences, um, it really gives you a perspective on college basketball as a whole and how hard it is. You know, I think especially in this generation, uh, with the transfer portal being what it is and everything that sort of what this generation is in terms of, of loyalty and people being quick to leave schools. Um, it's something that I'm super proud of that I've been here for six years with Coach Mooney, with this staff. Honestly, the best thing for me in my six years here is, has been the family atmosphere that this program has had. Um, Coach Mooney, like I said, their staff, all the teammates that I've had, um, I've made friends that I'll have for a, a lifetime. And I know those coaches up in the office would do absolutely anything for me and I'd do the same for them. So to have that atmosphere and sort of it be what it is, uh, it means guards, the world Jameer to me. Nelson, Gilliard helps out, comes up with the steal, runs the break, and finds Golden, and one. There's been so many great things that I've been able to experience in high school in my six years here, I hope that, you know, I get to move forward and continue to play and have some great experiences. But I know for a fact, and I've told him this, that there, there's been no greater experience in basketball than, than suiting up with Jacob for the last five years. Um, he means the world to me. He's my best friend, my right-hand man out there on the court. And the experiences that we've been able to have out there together and the things that we've gone through and persevered through out there on the court, it, it means a lot. And I know it means the same to him. And, I'm truly blessed to have the opportunity to play with him these last couple years. The things that he's done for me in terms of mentorship and friendship and how he's looked out for me even after he left here um, has truly been amazing and something that, you know, I don't even think he really understands how much I appreciate it. Um, so to have him here on Saturday and be able to present that 2000 point ball is something I know both of us will remember forever and especially me. TJ, one of the last weeks that he was here um, before he went off to go do his draft stuff and everything, um, we were hanging out in the locker room and, you know, he told me that when he showed up here, uh, Jero told him, you know, be better than me. And that's the last thing he told me was, was be better than him. And, uh, you know, like I said, I don't think I'll ever be better than him in my mind, but I've certainly reached things that I know he expected me to and um, to sort of go down in history as one of the greats here, it, it means a great deal to me. Obviously, I'd like to try and play after college and, you know, hopefully can play for as long as, as my body allows me. But uh, I think, you know, beyond that, I'd still like to stay within basketball, whether that's coaching or front office. Um, something along those lines is, is really what I want to do. I want to stay around the game and be involved and, you know, sort of sort of give that, still have that competitive side of things um, just, just from a different perspective on the sideline.